hello and welcome back to my channel so today's video i'll be upcycling this beautiful pair of pants into the cutest cargo skirt that i've ever owned so if you want to achieve that for yourself grab your tools and let's get going first you need to mark how long you want your skirt to be and once you have that marking you're going to cut along that point so i suggest you cut much longer than what you need so that when uh, you are already done, you can go ahead and cut out that extra bit of uh, fabric that will be left. So you're going to do that. And once you have done that, you'll be left with this short part. So we need to seam rip this uh, middle point all through to the other end so that we can open up the short to look more like a, a skirt. So yeah, I seam ripped that point. Uh, then once I was done seam ripping, this is how the short was looking, right? Next, you also need to seam rip this point up to that zipper part. So I did that, and here we have the sh skirt thing. So next, you need to pin uh, that front part and do a straight stitch, just a normal way. To turn your shirt into a skirt so i did uh, that and i i'm going first here because i already have a video of turning a, sh a short into a skirt so you can check that out so once i had sewn that part up now i turned the skirt now to the back then i proceeded to do the exact same thing i seam ripped the short yeah all the way to the middle point then pinned everything up then proceeded to do another straight stitch at the back but that was basically it for the skirt part the hard part was making the pockets and this is what we're going to do now so if you haven't checked my previous video on how i made this pattern please go ahead and check it first before proceeding to this video but basically you're going to take the two pattern pieces that we made in the previous video and you're going to pin them here i'll link the video in the description and also at the top part here you, you're going to see it so you're going to pin um, the pieces to your leg part of our pants and you're going to proceed to cut everything out you're, we already accounted for seam allowance so you're just going to cut everything out without adding any seam allowance First, you're going to begin working on these small pieces so this didn't have a lot of work to do you just needed to fold them into half with the right sides facing and you're going to sew along the seam allowance line so i use the pattern piece as a guide to trace out where the seam allowance uh, point will be into our fabric so once i had those uh, dotted points in place i proceeded to do a straight stitch at that point so then i did have to cut out the excess bit of seam allowance on the side just to reduce the bulk so i did that on uh, both sides and uh, also at the corner i snipped out a little bit more fabric so that the corners could turn out more neat so once i had already cut out the seam allowance i proceeded to turn the fabric the right sides out and here you have uh, the top piece of our pockets also now so yeah you, i'll do that with the other piece also then for the bottom piece of our pocket this had a lot of work so. you're going to fold the piece into half and if you've already checked the other video where i made the pattern you already know there's this three centimeter rectangle in the middle so if you fold it into half obviously on either side the rectangle is going to be distributed into 1.5 width so with that 1.5 width you're going to sew along 
that line but only on the seam allowance part at the top and at the bottom where there is seam allowance so i think it's better you see here rather than me talking because i don't know how i can explain that but basically i highlighted that uh, seam allowance part at that 1.5 point and you're going to end up with uh, these two lines at the top and at the bottom so here i'm trying to show you and here also i think you can get what i'm trying to say so you're going to sew along that line at the bottom and at the top so you'll end up with uh, this type of rectangle thing and once you're done you're going to take a pair of scissors and cut out that uh, excess bit of fabric at that point When you're done cutting and sewing this is how the front will look with this uh, like beautiful opening in the middle so you're going to iron everything out so that it uh, stays flat the back needs to be ironed so that it stays flat so this is what i did here so yeah we're going to proceed to the next and the next step is sewing that top part so at the top part there's a two centimeters uh seam allowance so you're going to fold it towards the ins the right sides of your fabric and you're going to sew at the sides so i did that off camera and once you're done sewing once again you're going to cut out that excess bit of seam allowance so that the fabric can turn much more neat when you're turning it out so i did that cut out the excess bit of seam allowance then turn the fabric the right sides out Once you're done there, the next step is to fold uh, the seam allowance towards the insides. Then I'm going to iron uh, them out so that they stay put. So that's what I did. I ironed everything out and this is how it looks. Next, we're going to grab back our skirt and we're going to take the pockets and place them on the skirts randomly just to have a rough idea of how you want the pockets to be and once you know how you'll be placing them we're going to start working on the top piece so measure them out to just make sure that they are equal on either side just to add a little bit more spice i use this uh i don't know what they're called back of pieces i got them from a bag that i wasn't using anymore so i attached one piece at the top and I pinned it in place then I did it also on the other side then I proceeded to do a top stitch at that uh, point so I did that off camera and here we have uh, the top part of our pocket all sewn out when placing the bottom pieces make sure that the top part of uh, the pocket is at the top so you're going to also place them on the skirt and measure them out to just make sure they're at the right level also. You're going to take the bottom piece of our back hole part. You're also going to pin it to the bottom part of our skirt. And you're going to do a straight stitch at the skirt on the sides and at the bottom of uh, our pocket you're going to leave the top part open so i did that once i reached the corners while sewing you're just going to pull uh turn the fabric so that uh, it is a continuous stitch all through so
for the last step, you're going to hem the bottom. Also, if you don't want that opening at the front, you can just sew that shirt. But I liked how that looked on my skirt. But that was it for making this skirt. So, yeah, if you liked it, please uh, subscribe, like, and share the video. See you in uh, the next video. Thank you.